Hey everyone, I'm Kathy Fawn and today I will be sharing with you guys where I purchased my lashes and how I apply my lashes. So, I order my lashes through a website called AliExpress. A lot of you guys probably heard of them. They are a manufacturing company that ship directly from China. So, I'm just going to link the vendors that I purchased from in the description box below and they've never given me a problem. I've purchased from them three times now. This is my fourth. Wait, no. This is my third time and I haven't gotten any problems every time I have ordered more than one lash. So the first order I ordered two, the second order I ordered five, and now I ordered from, um, and I did order from different vendors. So one vendor labels theirs as D and one labels them as E. So when I link these in the description box below, I will definitely, I'll put E vendors or D vendors and leave you guys a link because it is a little overwhelming when you look these up I think it's a little overwhelming because they have so many mink lashes so I'm just going to show you guys the different styles so these I'm just gonna put it by number order so these are do fives these are do eights and d20s these are just my personal favorite from trying to trying um trying all of the lashes out these are just my personal favorite so do fives they are wearable in my opinion well i just like one lashes so guys i don't know what's wearable to you guys but for me these are pretty wearable they're lightweight obviously lashes are going to be heavy if you guys never worn lashes before but i think these are pretty lightweight and they have they are a little wispy but they are still pretty full the do 8s as you guys can see, they are very full. They are a lot fuller than um, the do 5s and they are a little bit longer. And then the D20s, they are the most wispy and the least full out of these three that are my favorite. And I still really, really enjoy them. They are... Um, they all have the same band, which I really like. I don't really like a clear band because the lash doesn't last that long. These lashes, one pair of lashes for me, can last me one to two months depending on how much I wear them. And obviously you have to know how to care for your lashes. But it's just making sure you just... I just personally peel mine off. I don't like to put oil on them because I feel like it breaks down the lash. So I just peel them off. I just put a little bit of makeup remover and out rubbing alcohol and just remove the glue and just put them back in the container and they're perfect for probably... Honestly, they're perfect until I start cutting them and messing around with them. So they last a really long time and I really like the quality. So these ones, as you guys can see, they have a silver background and the E's have a pink like glitter background so i have the do i mean the e11s and e9 so as you guys can see there's definitely a difference in wispy and fullness as well Ooh, okay but i still i think these are super wispy and i really like that so which one do i want to want to wear today so i want to wear the e11s Okay, because I don't wear these super often, so I'm just going to show you guys that. Okay, so when I apply my lashes, I have, like like I said, my little lash kit. So I have eyelash glue. I like the dual brush on adhesive. I like clear. I don't like using black glue. I've tried it, but this is the thing. If you ever mess up and accidentally get um, eyelash glue on your lash, I mean on your lid, you... And it's clear you won't be able to see but but black eyelash glue will be on there and it will definitely you can it's just more of a hassle for me i just prefer clear so i like having a lash kit or something like this i purchased this at aeropostale but these this is just like a little manicure kit so it comes with scissors and tweezers and more tweezers like these are like just pointier tweezers and like other stuff for manicure but mainly what you'll be needing are these and tweezers. So the little scissors and tweezers are very important. Um, you can definitely use regular scissors. I just think that this comes in handy a lot more. And I like to have an eyelash curler. And this is optional, but it does help the lash blend. So I just use the Too Faced. I have a little sample size mascara because I don't really have lashes, guys. Sorry if you guys didn't know, but I think you guys can see. I don't really have lashes, so... 
I don't really need a ton of mascara, so that's why I just have the sample size. So I'm just gonna zoom in. What I like to do is first I like to curl my lash. The little tiny lashes that I do have. I just curled those to begin with. And now I take the tweezers that if you have the kit, it's very convenient because everything's all in one place. And I just take the tweezer. And what I do is I go at the corner of the lash so you're not messing up the lash and you just pull them off. Okay. Okay, so now what I like to do is place it on my lash line as you can see right there so I just put that right on the lash line and what this does is it gives me an idea on if I need to cut off any lash so I don't know if you guys can see but they fit pretty well i like that there's still enough space like if i have too much lash in the inner corner what will happen is um i need to cut some off of the end because it just ends up irritating my eye so i'm just going to do the um no, we're gonna do the other side next okay never mind so now we're going to take these scissors from the kit and i'm i don't know if you guys can see it but there is an extra piece in the inner corner and the outer corner so it's just an extra piece of the band that i'm just going to cut off so when you apply it the lash looks a lot more flush to your lash line okay so just cutting that off and now with my lash you want to go ahead and grab your lash glue and i'm just gonna do it this way but usually i would be applying the glue towards myself but it's just to show you guys so like this i'm just applying a small amount of glue all to the band so as you guys can see i'm doing this facing you guys but obviously if i was doing this myself i would definitely have it facing towards myself it was it's just a lot easier that way so make, making sure you have a nice and even coat on the lash. So when it's time to stick it on, you're ready. So I just like to let it get a little tacky for around 20 seconds. So doing that, I'm going to be applying my mascara in the time. In the time it takes to apply mas my um, mascara, that's usually a good amount of time for my lashes to get tacky. So just applying some mascara so there's a, it basically blends the lash a lot better. So I like to hold my lash like this, the glue's facing towards me and I'm just holding the tweezers really tightly. I like to flip my hand upside down and press against my lash line so the glue is touching the middle of my lash where I placed it. And I just like to hold the outer corner and just press it against my lash line. So just making sure that I'm getting it really close to my lash line because you don't want to gap. Okay, and now I'm just taking my fingers and just pressing it together with my lashes, like so. So now, um, the hairs are a little wonky, but once it dries, I'll be able to brush them out. So I'm going to come back with this eye done and show you guys what I do after that. Okay, so now just to finish everything off, I like to take eyelash curler and I like to try and fit these very long lashes in and just oh and just give it a curl so your natural lashes are now like blended with like they have the like, same curl as your regular lash so 
just make sure you fit all of the lash in because a lot of the times if you don't fit all of your lash in it can end up looking wonkier than you not curling it so just making sure you fit everything in and yeah so guys that's it so i know lashes i feel like lashes just make a look and i hope i did make it easier for you guys to find lashes and to put on lashes so i hope you guys all enjoyed this video all the all the lashes i mentioned will be linked in the description box below as well as all my social media and I hope you guys have a wonderful day and learn how to put on lashes with me baby girl oh let's just look at my iconic cup real quick bye guys